always put a new needle in when you are going to check your needle bar height. Turn the hand wheel towards you to double check and make sure that the needle bar is at its highest position. Once it is at its highest position, use the 11,000 gauge and place it on top of the needle plate. The tip of the needle should be touching the top of the gauge. If you look in towards the needle bar area inside the machine, you will see that there are two blocks. There is a smaller block on the bottom and a bigger block on top. The bigger block on top is our needle bar height adjustment. If you loosen this screw, you would be able to move the needle bar either up or down. As you're moving the needle bar up or down, you can easily place the gauge there and make sure that you can take the tip of the needle and place it on the top of the gauge. Always make sure to keep the needle bar very straight. You can tell by the groove or the indent that's on the front of it. If you rotate it, you will have problems with your clearance. Once you have found the proper height, make sure to tighten the screw without moving anything. 